Good morning everybody. Um, it's now day five um, in Phuket and I'm going for the um, PCR test. Uh, we at the Jung Siron um, test centre in Phuket. Um, I'm going to try and keep the camera running if I can. Um, just so you can see what um, process he is. I don't know whether I'm allowed to, to video when I'm inside getting the test done, but if I am, I will, but I'm not sure whether we are. So I'll turn this camera so you can see where we're going. Um, right, so we, we're just heading along now um, from where the big C is. There's a big C here, just so if people want to know where the area is at. Um, and the test centre is up in front of us to the left. It's in a car park, um, from what I understand, on the lower level. Um, the other day when I when I looked, there's loads of red seats, and apparently that's the area for the ties um, to get tested. Um, and the the foreign nationals for the the, the fifth day PCR test. From what I understand is up on the fifth floor. So hopefully this video um, is of some use to to somebody um, just to see the process of what they're doing. And hopefully I pass the test because from what I'm being told, if I if I fail then I have two options to either stay in the hotel um, for ten days and not leave the room or go to one of the approved hospitals um, to go and um, and stay with those on. I'm not sure of costs and I think yet I haven't been told anything because obviously I haven't test positive yet. So you can see in front of us here we have the car park area where the testing is going to be carried out. Um, so we've obviously got our face masks on and stuff uh, for coming to this area. Um, just so people are aware, there's lots of, I know they're saying the face masks should be worn in Phuket. If you go to the likes of Bangla Road and places like that, people are just choosing to, to do as they wish, you know, when it comes to wearing a face mask. Some people have them on. When you enter Bangalore Road, um, they do a temperature check and the people doing them checks normally ask you to put a face mask on. But as soon as people get into the road, they just take it off. So, just two seconds. You can see over the road there, there's Big C over the road um, from where the test centre is. Um, and but this area here where we are now is just a, a seated area for the ties to be tested. Now, from what I understand, we, we need to go upstairs on the third floor, so like that's a car park area. We'll go along here. Um, you see, I'll just keep the video run and I'll try to, to direct what I can with it, okay? As you can see, the Thai people there, they're coming for, I don't suppose it's a five-day test. I think they're just coming uh, to get tested as a matter of, um, to get checked, you know. I don't know whether we'll go up this way or whether. So you can see up on the wall there, we've got uh, the swab centre on the wall there. But, uh, Okay, come on, cop. As I say, I don't know whether I'll be allowed to run video up here. I'm not sure. Um, I think it's next floor, isn't it?
Right, so we've now arrived upstairs. Um, only thing is, you can see people are getting tested here. Um, I'm not sure whether I'll get stopped and told not to run the video. I'm not sure. But you can see the people here for the five day test. Yeah. As you can see, this is the testing area Where do we put the paper on there first? I don't know Okay, um, I've now come back, I've just been through the process of doing all the paperwork in behind us um, As you can see there, so the process was that we came in We needed to have um, a copy of our passport Our passport and the um, letter that you have paid for the PCR test, um, the confirmation letter for the PCR test. We then uh, came up to the first desk uh, where the, um, they came and uh, <coughs> they, they took the paperwork, checked what we had, then sent us on to the next station where the paperwork was logged in a computer. Then we were sent from that area to another area uh, for the paperwork um, to be checked again and assigned to a barcode. Then they handed the barcodes to us, then we had to go to another area where they checked and um, took the, the paperwork we had and the copy of the passport and the, the letter to prove that you'd paid um, off us, process, put it through the, the computer and then it printed off some more labels with barcodes on um, and they put them onto a test tube, which was, I'm sure you hear, was given to us in a bag um, with uh, the tube in. And now we're just proceeding to go up to the area where they actually do the, the swab test. As you can see up in the front up there, there's actually somebody up there now getting the swab test done. You know, I don't want to put two people on video, they may not want to be on. You know. um, so, as I say, I'm going to go through this 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 process here um, I'll try and keep the camera on as I can but obviously I've got to try and remove me mask and I don't want to be videoing uh, people that don't want to be videoed you know when they're getting this done I don't want people starting to kick off with us but I'll just keep this running so you can you can see a bit of the process you can see all of the equipment that they've got in here uh, to do the testing uh, everybody's dressed up in suits and stuff um, so we'll just have to see when we when we get up here. Um, <laughs> but it's not a very, I don't know whether people have had this done. Obviously, if you've come through the airport on day one, you'll have had this done. It's not a very pleasant thing to be getting done, you know. Um, whether they'll allow me to to run the video while I get the test done or not, I don't know. But I'll have a go. Don't laugh when I put it up your nose. <laughs> and, uh, I'll just take the camera off people over there because I don't want to. Don't want people to think that we video on them, you know. And, So it also looks like after they've had this test done, the asking people to uh, do a QR code. I'll just go up and have a look and see. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, need, yeah, I've checked my name. Do I need to take off now? Yeah. Yeah. Am I okay doing the video for when I get done? Okay. Yeah. Right, so here we go, um, as I say, we, they, they just... Okay, it's finished. Okay, sir, it's finished. Oh, only one? Yes. Oh, <laughs> I'm waiting for number two, okay, up and cap. 
I'll just put this mask back on. So, so do I need to uh, do the QR code off here, yeah? And pick you. Yeah, okay. Right, I'm just going to end this video here uh, because I need to do uh, the QR code on here. Okay, thank you. Okay, so I'm back out of the test centre now. Um, when they've done the test, uh, as you'll see on the video, uh, which I was surprised at, they only done one nostril. Uh, that was it for the test. Uh, all the other tests that I've been getting done, I've all had, uh, had two done. Um, so it, the process is just to, if you've had your test done at the airport, you, it's no different really apart from the money being four bonds. So it was a little bit different. The only thing I would say is that you need to make sure when you come here that you have a copy of your passport with you because they require a copy of the passport. Um, I don't know whether they've got facilities here to copy it or not. But uh, as I say, just make sure you've got uh, a copy of your passport. Anyway, I'm going to go now and okay. Thank you.